Courses in the Cement Industry Present to you In this session we will discuss Rotary Kill Thrust Roller The thrust roller is an important auxiliary part of a rotary kill. It is designed to control the axial vibration of the rotary kill, so that the tires and rollers can be evenly distributed on the full width. At the same time, it can ensure the linearity of the rotary kill body center line, make the big and small gears mesh well, and reduce the power consumption of the rotary kill process. What is the function of thrust roller for rotary kill? The main function of the rotary kill thrust roller, is to limit the rotary kill body from sliding down and up, and keep the axial position of the rotary kill cylinder stable. After the professional heat treatment process, the hardness and impact resistance of the rotary kill thrust roller can be improved. Another definition, what is the function of a thrust roller for a rotary kill? Rotary kill is subjected to a natural down thrust due to their inclination. The thrust rollers are designed to carry the full downhill thrust of the rotary kill. The down thrust is absorbed by the thrust device, hydraulic or mechanical. The function of the thrust device, is to transfer the axial load, from the rotary kill to one or several supports, and to maintain the rotary kill in the axial position. The rotary kill is an inclined rotating cylinder, and hence tends to slide down, by its own weight like a screw. It has to be prevented from sliding down, by a thrust applied either mechanically or hydraulically. The hydraulic thrust device might consist of, one or several units placed in individual supports. In case the thrust device consists of more than unit, only one the master unit, is connected to the control system. The other units serve as slave unit only, and connect hydraulically to master unit. The master unit is always placed, on the support closest to the rotary kill drive. The Mechanical Design, for Rotary Kill Thrust Roller 1. Riding Ring, Rotary Kill Tire 2. Thrust Roller 3. Hydraulic Cylinder Thrust Roller Hydraulic System If the kill tire moves downward, out of the neutral zone the following happens. The oil is forced to the hydraulic cylinders, which forces the rotary kill tire again. Thrust Roller Hydraulic System If the kill tire moves upward, out of the neutral zone, the following happens. The oil pressure in the hydraulic cylinders will now become so low that rotary kill tire can forces the pistons back, and slid down into neutral zone. We will present to you some videos from the site.
Thank you for watching, and I hope these courses are helpful to everyone. Subscribing to this channel Cement Industry Courses would be appreciated. Thank you.